let's try to find out the stress condition. That means the normal and shear stress of the given inclined plane, which makes an angle 22.5 degree with the vertical. Here, we can clearly see that the inclined plane makes an angle 90 minus 22.5 degree with the horizontal. With the aid of a calculator, we get the value 67.5 degree. Now, we have to draw a plane just parallel to that given inclined plane at control point A on Mohr circle. For that, we need to draw a line which makes an angle nearly 67 degree with the horizontal. That drawn line intersects the Mohr circle at a point below x-axis. Now let's get the point, which is vertically opposite to that intersected point, and the coordinates of that point is 1.38 and 2.15. So the normal stress of that given plane is plus 1.38 megapascal. That means tensile normal stress and shear stress is plus 2.15 megapascal. Since the shear stress is positive, the direction of the shear stresses will be such that they will create an anti-clockwise moment. And in this way, the shear stresses will be drawn on those planes. <laughs>